Hey YouTube, this is Kate. I'm gonna do another wish review. Let me jump on in it because I have this entire box full of packages. Right, right. This isn't even all of it. I have like two, is it? No, three bags full of stuff over there. So, first thing today. Oh my god, I'm pumped. Oh man, this is one of the things that I initially saw another girl do a wish review on and I was like, I gotta have it. If it's as good as she says it is, I need that in my life. So, let me take it out of this loud ass packaging. I hope it's as good as she said. Okay, people, this is a hoodie. It says milk. It is from, I'm guessing, Japan, though I'm not sure right now. And the pack has this cute little orange milk guy on it. She had said that the inside was so soft, which, yeah, it is. It's like, fleece on the inside. I like it. They had this pink, baby pink color, and I do think they had like maybe a tan color. That's why you take the glasses off before putting the hoodie on. I'm pretty sure I got like a big size, but it does fit kind of snug, but it's not too tight. Of course, I got the hoodie version. They did have t-shirts of the, the back and everything with the milk. But I don't have very many hoodies and I actually just really liked this one. I'm afraid I won't be able to take it off now without having my shirt stick, but it's way too warm to keep it on. So I'm gonna try. So the material, like, oh yeah, the glasses. The material isn't the stretchiest when it comes to like putting it on and off, but it is like relatively thick and it's definitely warm and it still fits. I like it. Ooh. Let me see if it says what size. The tag is definitely not in English. Oh, it says extra large, though. Not in English. Someone translate the washing instructions for me, please. Kind of just kidding, but if you translate it, I'll definitely take it into consideration when washing. I definitely am going to wash everything from Wish before I wear it for real, like... Hopefully, you all know to do that. It's shipping from China slash who knows where. Please wash these clothes before you like wear them. I know I'm trying them on, but even that like kind of makes me feel gross. Okay, that hoodie was called Women's Pink Sweatshirt Velvet Lined Hoodie Fleece Hooded Jumper Sweater Japanese Pullover Loose. I got an extra large. This was actually like probably one of the most expensive things I had gotten on Wish. It was $22, but it is like legitimate Japanese fashion wear, I'm pretty sure. And if not, it does a good job at making you think it, it could be, so. I like it. I'm pretty pleased with it. I guess it is summer now. It's not really gonna be like cold enough for me to wear it, but maybe there'll be some rainy days coming soon. Okay, I'm gonna open the next thing. Oh great, of course my scissors disappeared. I found one. 
Casper is playing on all the wrapping. If he comes over here, I'll, I'll grab him. Oh my gosh. This is something really cool too. Oh my god, they're beautiful. Okay, so I guess I haven't told you all this. I grew up dancing. I'm a dancer. My main types of dancing that I did were ballet, jazz, and tap. I have done point for ballet. I've done some point, but not in a long time. And out here, I just like really have been wanting to maybe practice again. So I got some point shoes and they're red. Oh my God, they're so beautiful. I love them. Here's the bottom. They say Lar L and a 40. The sizing for this was like a little tricky too. I looked up the size difference between American and I'm pretty sure Asian sizing, but I'm not, I don't remember, but read the comments. Ooh, Casper climbed on top of all my clothes rack. Oh my God. But read the comments, people. These are so beautiful. So in case you didn't know, point shoes at least for realsies real point shoes would not come with the ribbons attached this is something that real professional dancers always sew on them their selves for their point shoes okay so my sister just tried to call me and it interrupted the video then right afterwards Casper knocked over a huge box full of empty hangers on the ground. So I just spent like the last 15 minutes sorting a bunch of hangers and putting them in a couple boxes and putting the boxes away. So I'm gonna continue. Yeah, let me show you Casper. Yeah, I think he deserves to be shown off for this. Casper, look at this little crazy pussy. Mm, come on, baby. Aww. I don't want him to jump up where I have some candles. I've noticed he is like a typical son in that he does not like when I kiss him. He won't let me give him lots of kisses, which is really all I want to do. Okay. <laughs> Back to the last item I was reviewing, which were these beautiful red point shoes. I was just letting you know that usually the ribbon isn't attached. You are supposed to sew it in yourself. That way you can sew it in the perfect spot that fits like right on the arch of your foot so it like to laces up your calves in a very specific way because it all supports your ankles for having all your weight up in your toes. And of course these are like wooden, very hard tipped to go up on the tip if you don't know how to do point I would not <laughs> recommend getting these and just like messing around because you could hurt yourself very badly this is just like you're a dancer you need a couple of cheap pairs for practice or you just been dying for a red pair like this is perfect which has a lot of point shoe options they did come with these little toe pads I've used the jelly kind before um, or just cotton balls or whatever. But eh, these work too. All right, let me see if I can find this posting real quick. I've been really excited for these shoes. I, like I said, I haven't done point in a long time, but just to have them on and do some stretches with them and stuff would be really nice and just to go up on point a cup like a little bit it's like a good stretch they they might have had black ones too i almost got black ones 
Oh my gosh. Okay. Ugh. It gets so warm in my room when I'm doing these videos. And I think it's because I have three light bulbs on over there for the lighting. Whereas usually I just have one on. So I kind of need it for the lighting, but it kills me. Okay. The point shoes were called Hot Cell Point Dance Gymnastics Child Girl Ballet Dance Shoes for Adult Ballet. I got a size 40, bright red. They were only $13. If you went to a dance shop, point shoes are at least like $50 probably. Especially if you get a good a good one. So I'm not saying these are like, like, they don't have a brand name on them. They do have this emblem, but that doesn't really tell me anything. The bottom is like, it's nice like, I don't know what it normally would be like suede or leather but I don't know it seems good they are like a very damn they're like very hard but are they are they always this hard on the nail I'm not sure sure but I know well, with where they could like completely bend okay I'm gonna move on to the next item open this little black one. Casper. That's a crazy cat. What is it? Oh. This actually was for Casper. So, this is a collapsible travel bowl. For him to have food i think i got a different like a water bottle version for water so i mean it could be for food or water but it even like clips to his little carrier and it collapses completely flat it looks like it's silicon silicone you know that rubbery material and everything but yeah i like it oh pretty basic but it's definitely going to come in handy with taking him on little trips and whatnot, traveling with him. Because you can't forget to feed your pets when you take them out. Um, Wish just like totally crashed on me. Of course. That sucks because I had like all the things loaded. But I think I found it. So this is nice they definitely have like a lot of different colors and whatnot but sometimes one particular color will be the one that's free or something like that so psh, I just went with it it was called the collapsible dog cat portable silicone bowls water dish pet travel food feeding bowl it was free it says it was pink though in this lighting I definitely think it's red this clip's kind of pink, but the bowl is red, in my opinion. Eh. Like hot pink versus this red. Not sure. It's not even like the reddest part. Okay. It, yeah, it was free, so definitely worth it for Casper. I'm going to open one more. Um... I was able to splice these together all right and everything. Oh my god. This one is funny. So, it is this. So, I know what you're thinking. Another lipstick. What is she doing? Okay, people. This is the funniest damn lipstick I've ever seen in my life. So, it's actually in like a beautiful container. Wow. It's maybe hard to see, but it has like this design. The top is like a flower. This This was called End of Lubricus, maybe. So let me open this up and do the big reveal.
cartoon. Can you see? It's in the shape of a cock. Is this not the funniest thing ever? Oh my god, it's got like little veins on it. I just personally could not pass this up as like a gag gift. I, I got two of them because I was going to give one away to a friend. Oh my god, it has like the little slit at the top and everything. That is too funny. This is like the perfect gag gift for anyone, in my opinion. <laughs> anyone. Drag queens, chicks. I mean, not a lot of guys are putting on lipstick, but who knows? Maybe they'll want to put this little cock near their mouth. I don't know, man. But seriously, it's so funny. I like it a lot. I don't know if I want to put it near my mouth, but I might end up gifting it out to someone who needs an extra little cock in their life. <laughs> Alright, I think that will be a good one to end on. <laughs> Go ahead and comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff if you enjoyed this video. I will see you next time. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks for watching.